Hi there, did you know that you can create your house plan in 10 minutes? To start off, let's draw the exterior walls. Choose wall type in the catalog on the left. Select polygonal input. Then, click on the model space to start drawing walls. Drag or enter the length for each wall side until a room is enclosed. After creating a large room, next, draw the interior walls. You can add your bedrooms, bathroom or any room according to your desired size. Just click on the wall starting point, drag and click to end the wall. As you can see, software automatically assigns the room as room 2, room 3, and so on. Another option is, you can input wall length and press enter to end the wall. Now that you have created your room requirements, you can locate the doors in the plan. Select door type and design from the catalog. You can freely position the door or input reference distance. For the interior rooms, use interior doors and choose from the catalog options. Now, add all the windows to the plan. Choose window type from the catalog. Position windows by left clicking. Then, move cursor outside the plan to set the window opening to outward. Another left click to fix the window. You can either freely position the window by choosing free positioning input method, or set a distance from a reference point. You can also input windows at midway, just click on two reference points, in this case, the two walls. You now have a basic ground floor plan. Next, add stairs. By clicking on the stairs tool icon, several stair design options will appear on the catalog bar. In this example, we will add an L-shaped stair. Click on the preferred stair locations until the length is set. This automatically assigns the number of steps. After that, add ceiling. Ceiling is automatically cut out in the stairs area. Just click from an interior corner and click on its opposite corner. By clicking on the 3D furnishing mode, you can see the three-dimensional view of your design. To add an upper floor, go to Floors menu and select New Upper Floor, or you may select Ground Floor icon and select Add New Floor. Now that you have created an upper floor, draw exterior and interior walls for this floor. As you can see, you can use the lower floor as a reference guide for the upper floor walls. Draw exterior walls until you have created a room. Then, divide the upper floor into different rooms by interior walls.
In 3D furnishing mode, you can see that you have already created a two-level structure. You can turn off an active floor by navigating through the floors menu and select only active floor is visible. You can now add doors and windows for the first floor. Again, drag and drop doors to the plan and position by left clicking. If you are adding a terrace or a balcony, you may add patio doors and exterior doors. After placing doors, you can now put windows. Select from the catalog and position windows into the plan. With this software, you can draw floor plans in minutes, with the easy-to-use inbuilt 2D and 3D drawing tool. And with a huge library of objects, including walls, stairs, doors, windows, roofs and much much more, now you can draw your floor plan in literally minutes. Toggle 3D furnishing mode, to see live visualization of the plan. As you can see, I turned on all floors visible as guide for the next step. Click on the balconies, verandas and platforms tool icon. This opens the catalog and select balcony. Click on the corner to start drawing the balcony area and click to the next corner to close the balcony. Turn on active floor again to visibly see the created balcony. Now, we'll add railings. Click on the balcony and select border object from the top bar. Check on Show Border Object and select Load Object from the drop-down. This will show the object catalog. Find Handrails and choose Object. This will automatically add the railing. And finally, add a roof. By clicking on the roof tool icon, you can choose from different roof types. Select preferred roof type and draw the roof into the plan. Click on the first outer corner to start and another click on the opposite corner to complete roof. You now have a house plan to start with. To detail, you can also add objects into the plan, or change materials. With CAD Cabin, you can start planning your ideal home in just 10 minutes. For more detailed tutorial videos, visit cadcabin.com.